Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. what happened. Bob's uh, <laughs> the weirdest thing ever. You cross your arms and went, wait a minute. What if this? Bob, Bob's worried about the line of succession. In the, of for the, the crown. Of the president. Uh, for the crown. For the crown. Uh, <laughs> In the crown. <laughs> Can't for talk. the presidency, because I've had too some, many. certain people are old, Ooh. and I, I, I misspoke. No, that with Nixon, Agnew was already out because he committed some crimes, mm -hmm. some briberies. Mm -hmm. But you know, there's nobody gets prosecuted. No, because well, no, that no one will get prosecuted. Trust me, the America just doesn't do that. But, um, but then it is the vice president. But Nixon appointed a vice oh, president. Oh, you get to a point. Okay. He appointed Gerald Ford. I got gotcha. you. I've seen too many movies. Right. But if then if the vice president dies without having a replacement as the vice president. Like if it, they both go down at the same time. Then it's the Speaker of the House, and then it's Matt Bearden. Gotcha. I'm all right with that. Yeah, uh, because of my cool T-shirt collection. <laughs> What's that show? You didn't watch that show? I know. What was that show? The last survive. What is that? They, they actually – so if Congress – and the pre uh, State of the Union, where you have both bodies of Congress come together mm -hmm. with the president and the Joint oh, Chiefs I of Staff. You were really into this show no, for three for, episodes. I was going to say, it was like a hot week, and you were like, dude. And then no. right after that, you were like, yeah, I'm done. And no. I think, wasn't it? What my, was it my, called? I, Kiefer Sutherland jumped the shark for me with uh, with 24. I loved him in 24. Um, it's called the... Six, no, it's not Succession. It's called The Dude We Left Behind. But they actually take a congressman or a senator or something, and will, while they're having that whole thing where everyone is together, mm -hmm. just in case they all get taken out at the same time, there's a dude at the White House in the bunker who is the next in line. Right. Um, so. I know a, a guy who wrote a screenplay that was pretty funny about that. They found out that the entire Declaration of Independence and Constitution – was un unconstitutional the way it was done. It yeah. hadn't been properly ratified. Oh. And so we had to flip back to a monarchy until we could get it figured out. And so we had to go through the line to figure out who was the king. Would have been our king passed down from the governor at the time. <laughs> who and, and then it was just some hayseed <laughs> in, uh, in Arkansas. That's it, was crazy. it was a really funny idea. It's, uh... It was funny before, well... Before modern politics, and we realize that's essentially what we're doing. Yeah, it's the we're designated it. survivor, is what he's oh, called. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. But I, now I'm curious about, it, and this is not what I meant to do on camera. Sorry, it was my stupid question because I'm uninformed. I was an art. I went to art school. It goes like this: uh, the president, the vice president. If the vice president's incapacitated, then it goes the speaker of the house, president pro tem of the senate. I don't even is that know. senate leader? No, no. That's the president pro tem. What does pro tem mean? Just click, for a little click bit of time. On click on it. Uh, then it goes to the cabinet ser secretaries, depending on eligibility. So, hmm, there you go. The designated survivor. All right, so I don't like to I, – I can already feel – there's just days where you bring in prep and you go, well, that might be good, and then you get on the air and eh, you go – Be confident. I don't know if I want to do this or not. Be confident. I just remember it really bothering Daniel when we did this once. So the clickbait things that you see on the sides of pages. Oh, I meant to wear my fashion. Oh, I didn't put my light on. I meant on. to wear my fa Dude, I have started. So do you remember that lamp that uh, Cap City gave us as a Christmas present that yeah, year? I that still, Bendy lamp? I still yeah, have I it in my garage. garage. Bendy LDD. Well, I already had one. So now I have them on both sides of my desk. And Is I, there enough light? And I have a, a Xerox, you know, a, a box for printer paper. That I've taken a sharpie and it says Dale's Zoom box on it, and I set that up and for the, I I peeled those lights up today and I okay. go yeah and I almost just I'm too lazy I was gonna bring one in and plug them in right here to out to, to out light Bob where is mine but what's going on with your light did you it's not put yours late. on look dude we're almost we're done already with the, done with the, the televised segment, segment yeah. and you know how many light on you so I bet no one's seen you this entire time. <laughs> Oh, I hope he pulls a rabbit out of there. You, nah, Dale, keep that thought in. Just Bob looked like somebody to me with his headphones today and his hair pulled back like that for just a split second. My hair's getting long. But I'll I'll say it. Who do you later. look like? Nothing. Stop. Go ahead. What? No. It's Go ahead, 20, it... 30 years ago, sort of, looked like a Ron Jeremy. Okay, listen. I'm not fat and squat. No, like no, no, Ron no. Jer like Ron Jeremy, hedgehog. 30 years ago. Your hair. That's all. He's trying to say that you look like a greasy Italian. 
That's what he's trying to say. No. Hey. Yeah, he's trying to be racist about you Is and Ron your culture. Jeremy Italian? Yeah. Jeremy. His original name was Ron Jerome. Jerome. <laughs> anyway, you see this clickbait. I mean, well, have you the, seen that salami? I clicked on Get one. It? It's it, <laughs> and I it's clickbait. You won't believe the, these are pictures right before something horrible happened. Do we have any horrible music in there? Mm, let's see. Mm. Oh, no, I think the one where the girl is like turning and they're like, "This girl is murdered right after this photo." I think it's a different set though. Yeah, you brought those in one time, and it really upset Daniel because he was like, "That's a picture of a dead." Maybe person. that's why I'm feeling really weird about it. Because we've already done Bob, it. don't worry about your light, man. We don't have time. You might have lost it. All right. Well, this, this one we all know: John Lennon with Mark David Chapman. Yeah. Shortly before, John left to go to the studio and then came back. Incredible artist, Mark David Chapman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, that movie where Jared Leto played Mark David Chapman is way underrated. Is it? Just the fact that he gained that much weight and uh, just going through that mind. That, the movie. You know, how many people uh, has the, the catcher in the rye killed? I don't get it. What, Catcher in the Rye? Yeah. That's because you're a phony. Yeah, that's what phonies say. Is it? A big yep. phony big from old the phony. big city. Is it, was Pony Boy in that? Yep. <laughs> no. huh? All right, next page. Just tell me when you don't want to do it anymore. Okay. I hate stuff. What was, this, what, what was the thing again? That one's oh, that's Darker the, Side of History. That's the Lost Patrol before they uh, before their test fight, flight through the Bahamas, and then they disappeared. They got all those guys in that little plane? Did all of yep. them disappear? They just vanished. Well, the Bermuda Triangle the hot of the Bahamas. The left. <laughs> we'll just click. <laughs> just w- let's do this. Let's click through sidebar clickbait until we get malware viruses and <laughs> until the computer. It's your freezes. computer. <laughs> Go ahead. Like how many licks does it take to get to the center right. of the malware? Oh, uh, that's Marilyn Monroe, and she died later in the week. I didn't know she was with Buddy Greco. She's well, she a, got around. Yeah. No, no offense. Oh, yeah. Wow. But what? Let's name it. We got Slut we got somebody? Joe DiMaggio, President Kennedy, Neil, uh, the writer that wrote uh, Death of a Salesman, yeah, Herman, 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 Neil. Herman, Herman Miller, Neil. Henry, Miller. Henry Miller. Oh, I thought it was uh, Neil. And then, uh, hmm. well, there was a guy named Neil. I bet <laughs> somewhere. Did I say Joe DiMaggio? Yes. Yeah, and then uh, Buddy Greco, and then I guess there were more. I'm sure there were. were I'm sure there were directors. I think and there were a lot producers more. that. You know, all right, let's go through all the people your wife slept with. <laughs> the drummer from Blink-182. <laughs> what was the band? I'm Uncle Cracker. You. It's Uncle well, Cracker. You figure it out. Let it ruin your weekend. Why would that ruin my weekend? No, to try to figure it out. What it's do Uncle you call? Cracker. What do you call? Was it Uncle Cracker? Nope. No. What do you call a, not a doe, but a, not a female deer, but a male deer? And what's Buck the, Cherry. What's the best flavor coat? <laughs> Buck <laughs> Cherry. Where are they now? Huh? Nothing. I don't know. Buddy wanna, Greco. What was well, Buddy Greco? Hold, hold on. Did you say, could you say, where are they now? Where are they now? That's something Kendra Scott never asks. <laughs> Buddy Greco. <laughs> I was going to say, she walked away from Buck Cherry and ended up with you. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to see the Ron Jeremy come out. Don't no. think. Hey, don't oh, think about it. How fat are you planning on getting? <laughs> hey, do me a favor. Don't think. Don't think about those bubbles in your pool right now. Oh God! Wait, the bubbles are still there. Yeah. Oh, Bob, that's not good. I They're can't get attack out there until Tuesday. They are going to tear to... up that pump. All right. That's uh, all right. That's what I'm doing. All right. Here we go. These get bad. I stopped it. Uh, that's not bad. That's the last photo taken of the Titanic standing up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, where the hell is this supposed to be? That's the Titanic. Say, it's leaving port. Leaving England. And leaving who are England. those guys? Huh? Who are those guys that are clearly photoshopped they, into this? The, those are the Three Stooges. I don't believe this photo at all well, for one moment. Well, they're not in, they're not germane. This is the last photo of the Titanic. Tito? Hmm. Michael? All right, the next one's tough, guys. Oh, I shouldn't do this. This is uh, the last photos of Michael and Sean McQuillan moments before they were struck by oh. lightning, and you can see their hand hair standing up. I don't buy this. I don't buy this one now. Suddenly, I'm this not one sitting looks... here go- doing Google searches for you guys. This is from <laughs> History Daily. It's all true. It's dot org. It also it's says that true. both brothers survived. Dot <laughs> org. Oh, what, did they? Yeah. Well, that's no fun. Yeah. Oh. At the time, we thought this was humorous. Says one brother. Hmm. 
Hey, who's that girl on the bottom left? It's your mom. That's Jimi Hendrix having a cup of tea with Black Betty less than 24 uh, hours. Less than 24 hours? Right. Boy, there's all kinds of stories. You know, you talk about conspiracy theories. I have one. About, Jimi Hendrix about Jimmy's not, death. Jimi Hendrix would not be as famous as he is today if he hadn't died. Same for Bill Hicks. True. I think he had fired his manager a couple of days before or something. Read it. Look it up. I, I don't know all the details, hey, but there, there's, some, right. there's some fishy circumstances around his death. Hey, what's David Crosby okay, doing this there? One is, this, this, clickbait, <laughs> Who's this clickbait is not oh, as Mark bad. Mark Twain. This is not as bad as the one that we did with Daniel. This is uh, Mark Twain before he died. Okay. All right. Let's see. Oh, okay, that oh, one's boy. not good. Don't turn the corner! Stay Every, straight! Everybody in that photo is dead. No, they're those, not. Those babies I, that's are 1963, grown up. and I yeah. and I, that was that was my age. That's me right there. Yeah. And do you feel like you're alive inside? <laughs> no, but that's the exact age I was right, right there. Right. And are you dead inside? That looks like my aunt Jackie. What were we thinking? Driving people around in that looks like my aunt. open vehicles. It looks like my aunt Jackie. My dad always had a thing for. Were we that naive? Yeah, we were. We took a president. Put him in an open top car. Put someone in a, a put said, a pink target next to him. Just so they could, they could sight. But you are getting, you're, there's something you're leaving out. The Secret Service begged him to put, that car had a bubble that would go on top uh, right. that was bulletproof. And they begged him to put that bubble on. And he didn't want to because he wanted to be near the people. And then he was all over well, the Well, that's people. admirable, but not, yeah. somebody should have stopped him. And what is that dress known as? Mm, and what is their, what, that's a pillbox that's hat. That's a pillbox hat. I've seen that dress at the Smithsonian. They used to show it. They don't show yeah, it anymore. Yeah, that's the one that had uh, Bill Clinton's stuff on it? No, different dress. That was blue. Mm. What's this? Uh, this is a picture of a bunch of guys right before the uh, glider crashes. They're testing a glider, I guess, for World War II. Why would they put that many people in a test vehicle? Because you had to. A lot of people died in those they things. They could have put sand Can you imagine? There. They put, they put uh, tanks in those things. Can oh, you I imagine? Know. Yeah. A glider? Yeah. I don't know. Those guys. Oh, this one's this one's weak. Uh, 5, 000, oh, please go back. Can I read that? I want to read some of the copy. You so, don't want to see Sharon Tate pregnant? I will in a second, but I want you to go back because I want to read this to you, okay? Mm -hmm. In August 1943, 5,000... I'll 000, do it in the old voice. In August 1943, 5,000 spectators watched as one of the glider's wings snapped off at 2,000 feet and careened into the ground directly in front of the brandstand, oh, killing everyone inside. It was it, ruled a faulty bolt. Ah, I forgot to put this in. Ah, <laughs> they'll be fun without it. Poor Sharon Tate. Uh, th well, that was disappointing. I wanted more gore. It's almost as though I need to look ahead at what prep nah. I'm doing. Don't start putting effort into this show. It'll ruin the, the, the soul, hmm. what it's all about. Really. I don't think there's cursing in this one, Dylan. We're on camera right now, and it's a big deal if we have to hit the delay. Can't explain it to you. Podcast later. But here is um, uh, people have had enough of this Karen, and so has my computer. It's saying no more Karens. And... Uh, I am on PWB6, and it is not loading. There it goes. I don't think there's cursing in here. Let's hope And not. if there is, it's faint, and I don't want anybody to even point out that it's there because I don't want to cause a Friday yeah. Dylan. Apologize and move on. Apologize and move on. Yeah, I heard an S-bomb flew out from one of our sister stations. A uh, lady calling in, very upset about the election stuff. What's, oh, which, wow. which sister station? That's one of the show preppers said that. I don't know. Oh, that they heard an yes, S-bomb on... Huh? But yeah, I lay a caller. Someone s someone mentioned the poop word, and it got out on AM, which I think is positive because AM listeners love nothing more than be able to just take one regular poop. <laughs> that was Matt Bearden, B E A R D E N, employee number six five seven. Is management gonna come to me? <laughs> management gonna come and say, "Hey, did you suggest that AM listeners seven, are it? old?" And what am I gonna say? Yeah, I I did I'm suggest not, that. I, have, I, we, have we heard the ad I stacks for running? I wouldn't be surprised at this point. All right, go I've ahead. been I've been to plenty of remotes where I've had to work where a guy comes up in a walker and is like, I love your station. And by the way, and I'm like, oh, you're a rock fan. By the way, well, you got that, you guys are the talk radio. Did you did you use an extra? Coffee stir a couple of days ago. Did I use an extra coffee stir? Do you want me to say yes or no? I feel like you're leading oh me into something. Oh my god! Yes, you remember that? Never mind. 
the controversy. The I do remember say yes. Yes. It's going around. <laughs> you blew up my joke on purpose. Right. Write me a joke right now and hold it up. Because okay. you blew up mine. Okay. I don't no, know. Let's watch this. We'll do it later. Well, no, I'm all right. Okay. Gonna, is... I know what it's going to be. Steam clams. <laughs> now, where is this? What part of the hey, world? You're on camera. Be careful what you write. It doesn't matter. I'm just interested. Is this is uh, it's local... wherever Mr. Walton is running? Okay. This woman won't leave these people alone, and another woman gets okay. really upset with her. Read this part of the joke out loud. Why do I suck so many? <laughs> Here we go. I'll give you the answer. I tomorrow. just woke up. I just said something to you. Go get in your truck before you get smacked. <laughs> <laughs> the wo a woman's campaigning for some something, and, and a Karen walks up and won't leave her alone, and she literally just says, look, I just got up. But the... You know, there's a problem here. You don't, you can't touch other human beings without their permission. And she's got her mask yeah. around her chin. Oh, you get smacked. Now go now. I'm asking you to get out of my face. I'm asking you to quit pointing. Get your hand. Get, get, get out of my face, lady. <laughs> it's not going to end good. Uh -oh. It's not. It's not. It's not. Well, she's getting some. Karen's getting some licks in. Uh, I'm going to turn down just in case. Sorry it wasn't full screen, Dylan. You can be able to see this at 7 o'clock. Let's see how moms go. <laughs> Run. She's running all over. See, blood? Ms. McClain, you started that, McClain. You walked up in her face. I'll ask her what she said. You, and when you, you record this, you make sure you get the whole thing and don't slice it. I ain't gonna slice it. You will. You don't slice it. <laughs> you will. I think the word is at it. I think well, you looking. walked up in her face. We got everything she recorded. She said something. We, we, we got everything recorded, Miss I don't care. It's always one way with y'all. Oh. 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 oh! She said the quiet part out loud. <laughs> she said the quiet part. You people. That's it's two things. Something. Why is it so much fun to watch women over the age of fighting age <laughs> <laughs> to fight? Why is that always so much fun? And number two, because you know, you're not worried was, anyone's going to get really hurt. Was that not the nicest uh, language for a fist fight? I will say this: said, I'm get out of my face. Cursing. I want to see the fight get again, though, because face. I don't think the Karen ever touched. Yes, she does. Okay, she let me touches see. Touches her hand. All and right, the let's phone. see. I'm, right I'm willing to watch this again. I enjoyed it. I know about it. Okay, no I contact know yet. I just woke up. I just said something to you. Go get in your truck before you get smacked. Now go now. Now I'm asking you to get out of my face. I'm asking you to quit. Boom! Quit. Right there. All right, Boom. touch, touch first. Okay. She goes back and to the left. Okay. Back and to the left. Now, 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 most courts are going to say, okay, let's see what's the next move here. She po pokes her in the nose. Get out of my face, lady. Boink. Boink. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the guy not filming the... the he's the one who has to on, break bro. it up. No, no, else. Else. Come on. Come on, Miss <laughs> McClatchy. Get like, back in your on. truck, Miss McClatchy. You, you can hear her name. I forgot what her name is. Well, her is. name's on the back of her truck. She's running for office. She's no, a... no, 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 no. The the black woman, he, he's trying to get her off, and he says her name. Oh, the black woman's name? Yeah, he's he's trying to get his wife off of her. I guess it's his wife. Here we go. While filming it at the yeah. same time. Let's see. Listen. That's Sherry McClatchy. See who that was? I want to see. Is, is that? Are you sure? Uh, Let's see. Because uh, he says to no, right here he says, Miss oh, yeah. now Miss McClatchy, and he says that's. And you walked up in her face. I'll ask her what she said, you, and when you, you, you record this, you make sure you get the whole thing and don't slice it. I ain't gonna slice it. Yeah, <laughs> Spencer, don't slice it. Okay. And I'm pressing charges. Well, you walked up in her face. We got everything she recorded. She said something. We, we, we got everything recorded, Miss McClatchy. I don't care. Play with y'all. Uh, <laughs> who are y'all? <laughs> yeah. The same thing we asked. <laughs> they could be just the other team that disagreed politically, obviously. Dale, yeah. where'd you grow up? What part of East Texas you grew D up in? Was it, what did y'all always I'm mean? I'm not germane to this issue. What did y'all always mean? She has one political sign. The other guy has a other political sign. They could have had run-ins in the past. 
and she's fed up with that he, group. He just asked. Group. He just asked. What do you mean, y'all? Maybe let's. We should get an answer from her. Maybe she'll explain what she means by y'all. Okay. Oh. But y'all, who are y'all? You and anybody. Who are y'all? You and anybody else with a phone. Yeah. <laughs> See, she had a perfectly right. logical right. explanation. Right. She had a perfectly was, logical explanation. She met you people with phones. Right. I was absolutely <laughs> right. That woman's not a racist. <laughs> that's that's. <laughs> a, you people and anybody but, else. Look. Bob's, Bob, Bob on one right Bob. now. Bob, are you typical? Are you, are you yeah. Bob, y'all? Come on, are you shopping for jackets? No, they're Bob. charging. They're char They're they're charging the other woman. I'm sure they are. You know how it is with them. <laughs> Should have charged the black woman. Yeah, probably. She was the second. That was the second touch. <sighs> It was also the more aggressive touch. You I will say this. right on the nose yeah. <laughs> or face. Yeah, yeah. Let's be honest. Yeah, Pearly. If somebody Pearly pushed, Howell that's what was uh, the other Pearly. woman. That's what he's Pearly. saying. He's saying. And I think he's saying, "Get up, Pearly. Get up, Pearly." So the the Marshall County District Election Commissioner. No, give us the state, and oh. we'll figure out what, why she's being charged. Uh, okay, let's see here, Mississippi. There you go. That's mm. all you need. Somewhere to say in right Mississippi. There. There's never been race issues in Mississippi. None. None. Um. There's that great movie with Dude, the... I, I'm sorry, but who are you, who? What do you mean you all, you and anybody else with a phone? With a phone. Need to pull that. Was so I plan to. Yeah, pull good. That and don't slice it. Don't pull slice yeah, I that it, one. Spencer. I've been writing down the whole. Don't thing. slice don't it, Spencer. Slice it. Just to mark and pull out. Uh, uh, yeah, you remember that great Gene Hackman movie? Uh. Mississippi with fountains. <laughs> yes, I do remember it. Mi Mississippi and flowers. <laughs> Come on over our bridge. All right, we got a break. Thank you, everybody. Seven o'clock, you can see these. But if you're watching me, then that's redundant. So, uh, but it'll be at klvjfm.com. Where we're doing breaking and entering. And I need uh, you to submit families uh, that aren't going to have a great Christmas. Just send us a little story about them. Don't tell them. Breaking and entering at klbjfm.com.